Okay, now Neil. Six. Yes, now Mike. Six. 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 Mike. Hoaxed. Yeah, Neil. So I'm hoaxed. You are, yes. Good. Hoaxed for six, Magnus. We pay homage to both the contestants. We do. Homage mm. and hoaxed for six, but nothing more than six. So we go on. We have clickety click there for Neil and 63 for Mike. Three rounds left. Mike's letters. Consonant, please. L. And another one. S. And a third. W. And a vowel, please. E. And another one. E. And another one. O. And a consonant, please. T. And another one. F. And finish with another consonant, please. Thank you. And N. That's a TFN. Ta ta for now. Just six. Just six. Neil. Six. Neil's. Soften. Yeah. Mike. Towels. Towels. Towels, yeah. Towels. Soften towels, of course. Um, it's a six piece, Magnus. Well, one hates to be egotistic, but one can speak of oneself. <laughs> oneself. Yes, it's there for seven. Indeed. Very good, Magnus. Okay, that's a good one. Oneself is there. There it is. Well, the letters are done now, and it's dashed close thing here. Look, 69 and 72. So, Neil, you're going to choose his numbers. Uh, one large and any four small again. Carol, please. OK, thank you. I'm going to concentrate this time. I think I, it's the curse of the bard is upon me, Richard. That's what I think. We have two, nine and nine. Seven, five and 25 from the top row. And a target of 310. OK, ladies and gentlemen, 310, 310. Who's got that? Neil. 309. Mike. 311. <laughs> ah. Ah. <laughs> well, we go to 311 first. Go above it. OK. 25 plus 7 is 32. Yeah. 5 times 2 is 10. Yeah. Multiply it together and take away the 9. 320, take away the 9 is 311. Yeah. Right, now 309 for Neil. I got uh, 5 minus 2 is 3. 5 minus 2 gives you 3. Plus the 9 is 12. Yeah. So it's 25. 12 25s are 300. Plus the other 9. Plus the other 9. OK, 309. Right, well, what about that now? What about 310 in the middle? Uh, well, if you used a similar method to Mike and said 25 plus 7 minus 9 over 9, you get 31. You multiply it by 5, multiply it by 2, and you get 310. OK, well, well done, you, and well done, these two shouts. But look, it's set the scene for a very good finale here, of course. Round 15 is our crucial conundrum in this case, so please reveal, reveal today's crucial countdown conundrum. <laughs> That's the buzz on seven or eight seconds to say. Amusement. Amusement. Well... We hope we've provided some of that today. And here's more of it. Yes! Whoa. 
Well, that's very good. So, uh, uh, Dark Horse here comes in and uh, sneaks with the 89. So, uh, Neil Evans, the man himself from Birmingham, is the new Countdown champion. Well done, Neil. And Mike, well, well. Just been to it there. You're normally pretty quick on the conundrums, but uh, he had you on that one, didn't he? Yeah, I couldn't see what it was at all. No, OK, difficult one. However, we pay tribute to you. A very good scoreline here. As I said at the beginning, the highest is 112, the lowest is 86. Five very good wins there. And at the moment, as things stand, uh, you, you are number five seed. So there's a good chance perhaps we may meet again. Some wintry day, actually, because the finals will be in December. So we say farewell to you. And, of course, as we said at the beginning, Mike Brown, uh, off his own will and purely voluntary, he does the, uh, the, calendar, uh, the calendar, the Countdown website. OK, and it's all the history of Countdown is there. And now you are very much now a part of that, Mike, in your own right. So, you know, good luck to you and thanks very much for what you're doing for the Countdown website. And uh, here's a goodie bag of your very own. You've seen a lot of award. You've seen every edition of Countdown in the last 20 years. Thank you very much. And here's your own goodie bag, Mike Brown. <laughs> and so, coming across to this side of the studio tomorrow is uh, David Cross from uh, Normanton. David, well, it was seven or eight seconds. How'd you do? I was like Mike. I was nowhere near. You were nowhere near. But you'd, nowhere near on You've got way. a new champion to take care of, so it's a bit less daunting than taking on Mike, perhaps. Maybe. OK, well, good lad. That's David Cross. Uh, so that's him. That is... Those are they. That is her. <laughs> and as oh, Mike Yarwood said, this is me. But I won't sing. I'll just say goodbye. <laughs>